Jan Wayne Swayze presents the Free 99 Podcast. Be sure to follow us on SoundCloud, iTunes, YouTube, Wahai Radio, Spotify, Twitch, Instagram, and TikTok. Slowly but surely. Love I don't that. know if that's going to be a thing in a minute. Uh, search FRE oh, 99 Podcast. Shout out to all the sponsors. Give us our money. Shout out to all the listeners. Subscribe and click the thumb. Jean Wayne Swazel in the building. Jan Wayne Swayze. What up? Hey, JD Fresh in the building. Greetings, all you free 99ers hey. out there. Hey. <laughs> Love that. Kumo B in the building. Damn, what's the move? Can I tell the truth? If I was doing this for you, then I have nothing left to prove. Nah, just for me, though. I'm just trying to stay alive and take care of my people. Yes, sir. And they don't have no award for that. Trophies. <laughs> Trophies. Trophies. I am the good homie Gus, a.k.a. Mikey's Papa, a.k.a. Get Mi- that shit. Mr. Double Double Gussel Westbrook. Gussel Westbrook! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Mr. But in and out double double. Get it right? Yeah. Give him one more. Give him one more. Yeah, no, 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 no. That's okay, all we get. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah, get On episode 211. 211. 211. Of the free 99 podcast. Ramel. On site. Could you please introduce who we have? In the, we're in their building. I'm we're in their building. Actually in their building. Let's On location. It. Yes, sir. All right. 10,000 hours. When broken down, equals 20 hours a week for 10 years. Author Malcolm Gladwell states, the key to achieving true expertise in any skill is simply a matter of practicing and immersing yourself for at least 10,000 hours. I can say our guest tonight alone has easily surpassed that number. Mm -hmm. For 13 plus years, from finish line to Nike to Toby to Nordstrom to Sneaker Steez to Steezy Supply, he has immersed himself in fashion, sneakers, and streetwear culture. Jeez Louise. It's important. To note that Malcolm Gladwell goes on to say that the amount of practice necessary for exceptional performance is so extensive that people who end up on top need help, Mm. sometimes attributed to lucky breaks or chance encounters. Enter Aegis and Mark, where a call during a shift at Nordstrom's led to the creation of the Bay Area's beloved Archive SF, mm. who will be celebrating their sixth year anniversary this August. Yes, Sheesh. Six years surviving through a pandemic, mm. break ins, mm. a declining economy. Mm. Archive SF has not only become a place housing a collection of historical articles of clothing, come on, Ramel, but now holds its own place in history itself. Yes, sir. There it is. The Free 99 Podcast is honored to have Daniel Tanglo, one third of the owners of Archive SF in the motherfucking building. Thank you, Free thank 99 you, thank is you, in Archive Building. Oh, yeah, yeah. you're in your building. Free 99 is in Archive Building. Welcome, welcome, thank you, welcome, thank you, welcome, thank you, welcome, thank you, welcome, thank you for having us. I'm happy to have you guys here. Obviously, this is like one of the first love at in here. You know, yeah, what I mean? yeah like dude. Obviously, Sick. we've only been here since. Easter of last year, but you know we're happy to have it. It's been a journey, you know? man. Yeah, I have to open it up with a with a question. Please, you, yeah, do it. you, my friend, are a rare breed. Oh, thank you. Well, hold on. <laughs> when I say rare breed, I mean you are the rare breed of person who is a 49ers fan. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and a Lakers Let's fan. Yes, and a, and a, and a Lakers fan. I'm a hybrid. And I'm a, a hybrid. Lakers fan. He's a hybrid. Sometimes it's gas. Sometimes it's electric. I'm a hybrid. How is that? That's from that's be from your from a family. Yeah, member. yeah. So, growing up, my dad just watched Lakers games. Showtime. He was. Yeah. You popped the yeah. Showtime. Channel pop, Seven. My pop a little bit Showtime, later. I yeah. mean, he watched more of like Kobe and Shaq. Oh, oh wow. Wow. okay, okay. Your pops is my age. Well, obviously, yeah. <laughs> I mean, no. I mean, he he, he he yeah. He was watching Showtime, but. I'm a '90s baby, you know what I mean? Yeah, so yeah I, I didn't I really it. watch. I dig it. Much of Showtime, I just was more a Kobe and Shaq fan. So, so you, you also have two siblings. Yes. Are they also? And I know you are the eldest, who is basically the example. Oh yeah. yeah. Are you also? Are they also kind of like so of the same? 
my brother's a little so my brother he kind of jumped teams too he was a a, a warriors fan that turned into a clippers fan that turned back into a warriors clips fan. Yeah. was this lob cd clips yes okay so, okay yeah, that's yeah, understandable Paul, Blake, yeah. Blake yeah. Fan. Was it, like, it, it was either that or, yeah. or it was the kings or as laker fans oh, would no. call them the queens Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> hey shout out to Peja. <laughs> hey there you go and then my, shooter, si- my sister she was just a, a warriors fan so and what were the names Denica is my little sister, and then Derek is my little brother. Shout hey. out. Shout, Shout out to out. Filipinos and their naming conventions. Yeah. yeah, see? For their children. And my name is spelled the way it's, it's D E N I E L because my dad's name is Dennis. Mm. You that's smart a fact. man. There that's you go. A dropping facts. Yo, hey, shout out to Papa Dennis. Dude. Yeah, and then our middle names uh, all start with G because my mom's name is Gloria. My mom's name is Gloria. Oh, that's dope. I think they're related. No way. That's not how that works. I hope not. Yeah. <laughs> I, 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 ho- I, I absolutely hope not. Most Yo. Filipinos are related, but, but yeah. probably not that way. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah man. Damn. So I, it is. I have to say, I, I'm kind of like taken aback by the the setting like mm. this yeah. is your shot bro yeah. yeah the sound is so good the backdrop is amazing yeah thank you your skin clear beautiful thank you Yo, thank you thank and you. it's just like freshly uh tanned from 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 the philippines from the so Philippines. Geez. was that yeah. a, was that a family trip it was a family trip 100 percent family trip but wow. so you, you, know. you seem to be kind of like a man dedicated to his family oh yeah 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 absolutely you kind of have to be by default i mean i'm the eldest sibling and an eldest cousin on this side yeah um versus what, the philippines at what age were you the, the the babysitter for your family oh man the first time they left you home alone and be like hey I mean, my, my brother was born 15 months after me, so... Oh, sheesh. Ooh, a little Irish uh, twin. So he was, yeah, he he was this... He's the second eldest, so kind of, like, ever since I was, like, two or three, you know what I mean? Like, I was, like, taking care of my brother and, like... I like that. Being there for my brother. I, I love that, I see. And oh, what pizza that. were you guys ordering? Pizza... Man, we grew up on Little Caesars Pizza. Ooh, that's not bad. Little Caesars, just Little Caesars, up, and, and Costco when they had combo. Mm. Okay, Little, Pre- Caesars, Little Caesars Pizza is that the one in uh, Westboro? That's the one. Uh, not really Westboro. It's kind of up the street from Westboro. Gellert. King? Oh, uh, Callen. Oh. It was Callen. on West. It was. It used to be. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And then yeah, they changed. Yeah, yeah. They changed that to Sanuba. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, oh, it was Sanuba. When it was like pizza, yeah. pizza, yeah. like pizza, Little pizza. Caesars. Yeah. yeah. I'm right. I'm we, used to, we used to pull up uh, at Little that Little Caesars right before they closed every night, and they would just hand out pizzas for free. Oh, I swear. That's they, that they, hot and ready shit before it was away. That, dude. Why do you, throw it away. How do you have like this? This is hot, connect, hot and ready, hot and ready when it was like $5. Yeah, that was uh, a thing. I think it was still might be, but I think it's did only you, like select. select. Did you find stuff. this out like on a, on like Nike Talk or something? No, no, no. I found this out <laughs> on a whim. Me and my dad were like, damn, where, where should we get pizza? And it was like, uh, damn, near closing time. And then we saw the uh, employees just walk out a bunch of pizzas. Hopefully they don't get in trouble, but, but I don't know if they do that still, but. Yeah, that's how we came up. And shout out to little Caesar. Shout out to employees who work at places and honestly don't give a fuck, dude. Yeah, yeah. they just—I mean—they throw away the food regardless. So it's like you might as well, you know, feed feed some families, you know. So yeah, man, that is sick. I didn't know they did that. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm pretty sure a bunch of other places do that too. You know. Yeah, yeah. Like at the end of it and stuff. End of shift. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sure the employees are tired of pizza anyway, so. I mean, crazy bread's not even really that good. I'll be honest. Maybe yeah, it's not take, as good as it is now. I mean, it was back then for sure. Because yeah, it's Parmesan cheese. You said it was yeah. that or Costco for y'all pizza. Yeah. W- what if you guys wanted to support? Like, it wasn't like Round Table, the one right no, there. No, Round Table. I mean, I grew up on the other side of Daily City too, like where what Westmore, where Westmore is. So Skyline area. Pizza Hut. Yeah, we were big on Pizza Hut as well. Oh, Shout right. out to Pizza Hut gang. They dog. changed that into uh, Mountain Mike's. They Not, did. Yeah, Mount Mike's is expensive. It's bro. okay. I don't really like Mount Mike's. It's okay. Ooh, that's a oh shit. Just, is that a hot just, I do fuck a round table though. <laughs> no, I just had to ask. Did anyone ever try the pizza buffet yet at Mount Mike's? Just, I'll be honest with you. You are the only person I know who goes to the pizza buffet. I like that. <laughs> go by myself. I, I, I like you. the pizza buffets at uh. Uh, pizza, not pizza. Hut, round table. Round table. That was the best one. That was the best one. Yeah. And they're never gonna bring it back because I've asked them. We don't have it. Not anymore. What? After COVID, they they ended. Oh it. yeah, yeah. yeah. And sense. I've actually tried when we opened back up. Yeah. I called Coma. Like, are you guys ever gonna get it back? Damn. And they're like, no. They That's all crazy. used to do it all the way down to like San Francisco, yeah. like mm-hmm. all the way in, in the in the Excelsior, all the way up to yeah. What's more? Yeah. I have a, yeah. I have a good yeah. question. We said, damn. Was it damn that they stopped doing it, or damn you called? He called. <laughs> he's, he's like, like damn. He's like, damn, I you called, called bro? Oh, you really that, called, bro. Him, huh? yeah. That's respect. I mean, that used to be popping for me. Yeah. Salad bar. 
everything. They used to throw wings in there too sometimes. Yeah, I think I seen a, a West. I think I seen a, a Warriors championship at the one in Colma. I forgot which one. Yeah. Anyway, so you you are the eldest amongst your cousins as well. Uh, that live here in the U.S. Yeah, yeah, on my mom's side, at least. And are you guys like all tight knit? Oh yeah, because we all pretty much grew up in the same area, and then um, my family, some of my uncles and aunties, they live in uh, Fairfield, so oh, Fairfield, okay. Vacaville area. So y'all family parties must have been popping. Oh yeah, they still are. Pretty I popping. I love the era of like going to a family party and you don't know where you like you, you're gonna have to fight for a, ch- a seat somehow. Yeah, all the kids are running around chasing someone. Yeah, like that was like the era of family parties I grew up with, and I don't I don't see that now at like Christmas. That used yeah. to be like our Fridays. I mean, aside aside from like obviously the holidays we're all together, but like Pacquiao fights we always always oh, used to be. Like, Pacquiao, oh, Pacquiao kids fights, will never dude. understand the never, impact ever of a Pacquiao ever fight at a, at a family party. It was a national holiday. It, it was. was. I tell you. It was I everyone t- called out so until, we, we grew up lost, on that until, until he lost a couple but we, we were so still there we were still there though yeah yeah yeah, yeah. I was still at the party mean, so. yeah we were still yeah. eating yeah, the, yeah. yeah that that was the peak of like our like growing up like just getting together for those parties aside oh. from holidays because it was a Philippine holiday you know what I mean and you're kind of like you know you're into fashion you're into kind of like pop culture yeah I feel and please correct me if I'm wrong mm-hmm. that you had an effect of what Trey you would bring to the party you'd want to bring some fire shit. oh yeah for sure all right so tell <laughs> tell us your top three things that you would first aim for at these family He's parties. A, sorry he would he would bring or or food that he would uh he would uh provide to, yeah. yeah provide no, that he would bring okay, okay, like, okay. And yo like oh yo oh daniel brought this oh shit i've never seen that before i mean i wasn't really big on like obviously like making my own stuff for no, parties. no 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 yeah but you know like, uh but ordering for sure like I, I, my cousins will tell you uh, I'm pretty big on like ordering Wingstop for them. Whoa, big spender. Yeah, yeah. Wingstop. Wingstop gets Wingstop? pricey. Yeah, yeah. man. Dollar yo. per wing Dollar minimum. Per wing. Yo. Uh, how many? How many cousins are there? You on must the own your own business, guys. There's for sure more than ten of, maybe more than twelve of us cousins that are twelve that cousins. love Wingstop. So I have to order like the fifty, sixty piece, and that that gets up to like a hundred dollars dude that's if like you get the family pack how many sneakers you got to yourself yeah see exactly yeah and then what's number two what's number two uh it's funny you mentioned pizza earlier but pizza usually oh these are like just a- the easiest to get you know yeah yeah but you, but you gotta put i, I feel like because 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 my because my aunties and uncles and my grandma and all the elderly people obviously they're gonna munch on the filipino stuff but like yeah. the kids are super picky sometimes right so all they eat is pizza and chicken wings you know so. american born feeling yeah, go see what was your first item you remember reselling? Ooh. Oh man! Like you remember, like oh, I'm gonna sell this to so and so, or good question, sir. This is like you know, it could be I like. I actually high have school. a funny story. It wasn't so much reselling because I didn't really. There wasn't really enough money for me to make back then because I didn't. It wasn't like a thing called reselling back then. I used to, I used to, I used to obtain shoes sometimes for doing my friends' homeworks and like homework assignments and essays and stuff. Mm. Wait, wait, hold on. So my earliest What's memory, uh, I mean, I, I did a paper for one of my homies. I think this is the, like the, the one of the first memories I've had of like what actually got me hooked onto this, um, the sneaker culture at least. I did a, an essay like one of those end of the year essays. Yeah, like yeah. A end, like a like a, a thesis like a, statement like an English that. paper from one of my homies. I don't know if he remembers it either, but I did a paper for him and he threw me some uh, infrared nineties. High school infrared Air Max nineties. Yes. Was, this was middle school. Middle school. Uh, I think they were Warren, but we were the same size, so he he hooked me up. New to you, else. shit. So I did like a three. I think I did like a three or four page double space paper. For Hell him, yeah! And he, That's he easy work, dog. Oh, so easy work. Did 20, you hear that super intro, easy work. Bro, bro? Twenty font. Super easy work. Yeah. Cover page. Easy. <laughs> easy. Easy. <laughs> easy. So that's what kind of got me like into like trade for trade. Yeah, just you know doing what I do and like understanding the sneaker culture back then. As a little kid, like just browsing Nike Talk and, and so collectors. What is that the illest shit I've heard, ever yeah. heard, dog? Yeah. Like, yeah. Essays for shoes. <laughs> essays for shoes. Yeah, man. They don't do it like that no more. What was the first shoe that you requested your parents to buy for you? Like it was <gasps> specific to like I wanted like, Good question. I want I want this shoe. Like 
my friends, all my friends have this shoe, or I seen this shoes coming out. I, I, I'm looking at the East Bay oh, catalog. Man. Here's another funny story. <laughs> this wasn't in like East Bay. This was this was in person when I when I finally grew out of the grade school size. Okay. And started wearing from like a seven to seven and a half. Oh yeah. And you know that price jump back then was 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 pretty big. <laughs> yeah. Anything well, hundred bucks was like shit. a yeah. Shoe. Wearing, but like but like I remember kids' shoes back then, like a Jordan. Uh, it was a fire red Jordan three, and this was two thousand seven. Um, retail on those I think used to be like 90 for grade school and then the jump from grade school to an adult pair 125 goes up 135 yeah. actually I worked at Foot Locker so when having, those dropped so having to ask my parents for like Ooh. something like that is a little bit more nerve wracking because the price jump Anything over a bird is like expensive. Exactly. Right? Yeah. 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 Why do so, you need that one? So yeah, that that would probably be like one of the first ones I asked my parents for help for because I needed that extra help mm. to make up for that what forty five dollar difference. So. What What is your most favorite Filipino parent comeback <laughs> to why you have so many shoes? Uh, Mine is you only have two feet. Mm. Yeah, see, that's that, that's that's one. a classic. That's dude. one. That's a classic. But my my mom, she collects like handbags, so like she. Oh, mama! You know what I mean? So my mom has my mom has a collection of handbags, and so so does like my grandma, and my auntie. So what's her like most fire handbag? Uh, I mean, I don't really know him by name, but she has a bunch of Louis bags. But yeah, like, she does. Yeah, she doesn't really dabble in like Gucci or anything like that. But Louis bags, that's 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 one of her addictions. So the 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 bag at the the purse and uh and like shoe shoes for yeah. like women, my boy broke it down to like that's like our hats and shoe collections. Yeah, like yeah. that's our accessory, right? Like exactly. uh, I remember when like when fitteds was like just twenty bucks. It was yeah, like twenty bucks for oh, fitted. Yeah, 25, 25, 30 Yeah, you got the little hat club car. You get a little ten percent off. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, Shout out to Nico. But I think my I think my I think my main shoe addiction started with my dad too, because my dad my dad collects and still kind of. Dibbles and dabbles whenever I give him a pair, but Jordans are like I'm assuming Kobe's because Jordans. I mean, he 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 grew up on whites, the OG white cement fours. How old is Pops? Nines. Uh, My dad is fifty. Sorry, Dad, I don't mean to age you on here, but fifty five, fifty six. Bro, he's he's closer to our age. We should have had him on this. No, he's older. (laughs) Shout out to Pops. Shout out to Pops. We'll get you on the next episode. He's for sure older. Maybe fifty seven. I want to say fifty seven. And he's hella steezy though. He 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 gets down. Yeah, he he can dress. He can dress. What sure. was the first you you seen him like, and you knew that was a oh, that oh that's a pair of Jordans or that was a that, uh, yeah I know exactly either either an olive nine I don't know what year Ooh, they came out. Olive nine. Your boss is rocking olive nine. Do we have a, we we I mean we have the boot version, but but those olive nines right here. But boss is wearing those. What kind of yeah. jeans? Uh, he was wearing darker denim jeans. So darker, like gray, gray, black denim jeans. Um, those 54. and then uh, playoff, playoff nines. So same, Ooh. same model. But, uh, Damn, he's, just, he's out here dressing like Jerry Seinfeld. Yeah, Shit, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was that was my dad. Yeah, my dad the same. My dad had the same pair, pair of Cortez for like twenty years, I think. Yeah, it was yeah. just the same color. I think you, you can't just go, kept I mean, rebuying you can't, it. You can't go wrong. You can't go wrong with it. That, Super that clean. Was, uh, yeah, right? exactly. Yeah, he yeah, with everything. Yeah. So yeah. Did he also clean. only wear his uh, button ups with the top button all the oh, way no, up? That's, hey. Damn. Oh my god. All Maybe he was uh, trading essays for shoes. Yeah, yeah, love you, pops. Love yeah. you, pops. Love you, pops. Are you? Uh, you just said you came from the Philippines, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just on vacation, a little three week thing. Was that a little three week motherfucker? I'm having three week <laughs> yeah. That never. plane ride is yeah. crazy. Oh yeah, it's crazy. Do you usually travel with like family? Uh, for the most part, yeah. Uh, overseas and when I'm visiting family, yeah, obviously in the Philippines, yeah, I visit with family. Yeah, that's that shit's humbling. Yeah. Oh yeah, it is. I mean, it's a lot different now. It's a lot the, different. I don't depend, know depending the, what island you go to. Yeah. yeah. Right. Yeah. I mean, like, my hometown in the Philippines now is like. There's like normal malls and there's like Uniqlo. And you was in like, you, you was oh, in Boracay, right? There's like yeah, I was at, I was in Boracay for like three days, three four days. And that the island that you get to to get to Boracay, and then you take a boat out to yeah. the island, right? Yeah. So that island you you take a plane to, like yeah, Duarte cleaned all that up. Yeah. And yeah. Pe- people don't like him, but he cleaned that that clean house. Yeah, and that's that's what kind of like gave him that kickstarter. Everyone started fucking with him because yeah. you go there, like it's. It's super clean. I would say it's not as crazy as it is, as it is like back when he was cleaning up house. Though now it's like it's like who's the, who's the president now? Marcos, know, right? Can, yeah, I don't know, can, bro. I can't ask. Mar- it's, it's Marcos's son. Marcos, yeah, yeah. It's Marcos's yeah, son. Yeah. So, can you tell me about uh, a trip to Cabo where you almost lost your Easy oh Slides God. drug? Say it again. Easy a trip to Cabo where you yeah. almost lost your Easy Slides drunk. 
Oh my god Okay So this uh, This was like Maybe day two Of my bachelor party Um Girls gone wild Shout out to bachelor parties Yeah and Those so are the best So uh, So I just got super faded at, Cause my homie came A little bit later In the day In the trip Cause he He wasn't there For the whole trip But as soon as he came And we were staying At an all inclusive resort So Nice uh, Yeah I'm eating You know how that goes Like yeah. all the drinks all are free All the drinking the free, the Frozen margaritas are free So we just start Down in drinks As soon as he gets there He came He came straight from the From the airport To the hotel Changed Went straight to the pool And we were already all in the pool And then uh, we were just down in drinks I have, I'm have i not going to show the video but I <laughs> was, no, There, no, there wasn't a video There isn't a video I was, point blacked, at your boat, dog. I was blacked out drunk Like like people people saw me from the pool And they see me at the club later on in the day And were like hey You were the one that was blacked out near the pool With like chicken nuggets on your chest Because so, my, my, my boys, are, my boys right. are messing with me The chicken whole time Chicken nuggets on your chest Yeah the whole time They're trying to get birds that as you are Yeah they're pouring, they're pouring drinks on, on my face And like all that So I was done Damn, they had me like in the club, like fucking uh, weekend at Bernie's and shit. Yeah, <laughs> like, exactly. And I, I almost left my slides at the at the pool, so someone almost came up, but my homies were able to grab them for me. So hey, shout out to the homies. Yeah, shout yeah. out to the boys. Always, yeah. to the I boys. know they're gonna watch this. Sure, making sure you stay fresh. Yeah, Gotta yeah, stay fresh. Yeah, and what I, do you and think I, of I those? Help, I helped them out too. So what do you think of those Yeezy slides? I mean, they're comfortable. They're they're good vacation slippers. But it, I'm not gonna wear them out it, or like, house slippers. <laughs> as far as comfort, mm -hmm. right? Like yeah, could you wear those all day or a pair of Crocs you can wear them all, all day. day? Really? And Crocs, Crocs too. But I don't know. Croc, Crocs are Salehi Crocs are dope. What and you, I see, I see you, I see you rocking a pair. I, <laughs> I, almost, I almost went to Echo Crocs. Storm. I almost went to Echo Storm. Today, I love, I love Salehi Crocs. They're su they're dope. But. But that's it. They're dope. Okay. <laughs> he said, "Boy, like, they're dope. They're dope. Boy. They're dope. Yeah. I love. I love Crocs. Crocs are cool. What I are love, the, what are I the other Crocs? Ones? I yeah, like Crocs. I like Crocs a little a little early on too, because uh, a couple yeah, of my a couple of my homies put me on to Crocs before. So I had to. Be I, least, I'll never. Yeah. I'll never have a bad thing. Was your homie to say named Mario Batali? <laughs> no, no, no. My homie. Uh, you guys. You guys. You might know him. Ken Guzman. You know Ken Guzman. Ken Guzman. Shout out to Ken if you're, if you're watching out. this. Shout I don't know if you're gonna watch this, but with a C because you talk about Ken. Crocs, bro. What shout you got, Justin? Ken, no, JD Fresh. I just want to say because, like, um, I don't know what it is those those Croc Echo slides though. I, Echo, Echo I, slides. I wear them like a hundred percent when I'm not at work. Like right now, I was gonna wear them here, but Echo slides. They're Behind like are those the ones with a bunch of holes. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, dope too. Yeah, and like I don't know why. There's something about those slides that are like super comfortable, dude. Yeah. Like yeah. more than any shoe. I mean, it's just crazy how slides have just become an acceptable choice of like footwear right, nowadays. Right. You know, I'm just happy. Yeah, like even that. even at the gym. Do you oh, guys yeah, see yeah, that? Yeah. Oh, croc, yeah. like croc clogs? Crocs the at the gym, easy slides at the gym. Yeah. Just people just lift, just kids just lifting. And no like, one drops shit on crazy. their toes. I get huh? it though, right? <laughs> they, have good, they have good grip. That's all I know. The kid, wait, the kids lifting or the crocs? The kids lifting. I mean, obviously, the, with, with the crocs on. <laughs> with the crocs on or the easy slides on. You know what you see though? Is not, it's funny. You see the. Uh, you see how other brands pay attention to what Croc is and make yeah. their version of it. Yeah, even Nike, Nike and Jordan, they, yeah. they they make slides that are you know similar in style and shape. I so. got them Shout all. Out to but Crocs, honestly, to me, are the most, most comfortable. comfortable. Yeah. It's, it's it's tried and true to me. I, uh, my wife put me on them early, and I was like, For "Real babe, Crocs." Yeah, the thing is with the Yeezy slides, like they're cool, but sizing is always an issue with those. Yeah. Mm. Could like you throw them in the dryer like the Crocs no, to, to shrink them? No, 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 they're gonna for sure. They're gonna they're gonna shrink and fold. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's, yeah, it's like the yeah. reverse of like Back to the Future too when you put the small even pizza. even leaving your Crocs out is is pretty bad. Yeah, no, I in hot weather. In the sun, oh, oh yeah, it's, it's a wrap. What well, do so they cook it like Teresa? Right, it'll just shrink. It's, it's rubber, so oh shit, they'll just shrink. Yeah, for sure. I mean, we if you live in Daly City, you're good. Yeah, that's also true. But if you live if you live up in Sac, that's on like no nine to five. It's a wrap. Far away, it's a wrap. Exactly. Bring your Crocs in the house exactly. I'm sure you probably like Bought pairs of like Crocs Like you know The Salehis and stuff Yeah 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 yeah, yeah. We have We have pairs back here Yeah And we again like right you here. You my friend Are immersed In this shit Yes So you could probably like I bought my favorite shoe From your store What's And it, it, it was a Oh I love these stories Philippine Air Force One. Oh my god I have I have two that pairs was the 13 Size uh, Size 13 Size 13 He hit me And he was like Hey they have these And I was like That's funny Who are you you did, yeah, I did. I just want to hear it. Cause <laughs> I That's love, funny. I love those shoes. Yeah, cause it's um, 
representation matters as, oh, as yes. water is da- as watered down as it Absolutely. is yes. they they seen us then right Absolutely. So they seen us then and they seen the impact and uh that's a shoe i feel that will never get reproduced yes um my first pair i traded in a shot to redwood i i, sh- I traded a pair of uh, oh, che- cherry 11 lows and i had to pay like 25 bucks just yeah. to balance it out but it was it was just a shoe no box and then my second pair is from y'all and it was used but it was a cl- it was super clean yeah it's probably uh, it was probably my partner's pair and right yeah because usually pairs yeah. that are i was just telling i was just telling them so all the shoes that are usually like of a size 12 through 13 are from from you just saw yeah and He's it's blessed it's, in the shop yeah it's shoes that's it's, it's your shoes yeah it's your shoes your mm-hmm. size mm-hmm. Um, me and Ramel were here on Saturday and then, you know, just kind of scoping the spot for the for the pod and just me and Ramel kind of sat back and watched you work. And then there was a young kid that came in. Yeah. And like you talked to him and it was it was a it was an honest deal. But he just didn't have like the Venmo or whatever. Yeah. And He's then, like, my mom's going to get back in town. On like, yeah. Sometimes we don't carry cash just for safety reasons. But, you know, on, there's instances. They never where, carry cash. <laughs> there's there's instances where we, you know, we we have to send it through e-payment. I, I mean, Which is super every, smart. Every, every other store, every other store does it. So. Yeah. Um, I just thought the the I, I seen how that operated, and he was a young boy, super young, super young they, boy. They only get younger, man. I'm telling you, like the the kids that are into shoes right now, or especially in this area in Berlin game, like they're just getting younger and younger, and and they're into some really. What's the address stuff. here, just just for everyone? The address is 1419 Berlin game Ave. So we're on Berlin game Ave in the Fox Mall. Happy Lemon. Happy Lemon. Look for Happy Lemon, Lemon motherfucker. Get that Same cheese on that drink. Lemon, yep. Get that cheese on that drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's so weird. We're all, on the second floor, second floor second of uh, floor. Fox Mall. So, for I buy all the salons. So follow, <laughs> follow the girls. You find them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're they're all over here. So, <laughs> I so you know Gus shared that story. I have to share a story as well. Yeah, you've came to the house and you've cashed me out on certain parts of mm-hmm. my collection. Yeah, one time that you did cash me out was for the trip to Japan. That I went with my mom. Oh, yeah. to pr- propose to your uh, to shout to Therese. It was where I did propose, but most importantly, the trip to Japan was the last thing on my mom's bucket list. Oh, that's dope. Oh, that's yeah, dope. man. And she, you know, she has uh, liver cancer. Shout out to mom. Shout out to oh, Shout out to mom. Fucking trooper, dog. So, you know, I heard on past podcasts where you talk about seeing these kids from high school to college now, right? Mm -hmm. The effect that you have, right? It resonates throughout the entire community. Thank you. So I want to say thank you. Thank you. For creating these things. And And I I, I love hearing these stories, obviously. You know, growing up, um, I'm I'm 30 now, so all my friends and all that, they're all all getting engaged and (laughs) they're all getting married. So they, they, they kind of, some, a lot of them come to me just to cash out on, shoes you know just so they can make that next move in their life so and I it's love fair it. it's super love fair it. and you know yeah. shoes are investments guys exactly but, investments. But, but you you price it and you move it where everybody wins it's very fair you know what you're talking we about we try to yeah you know the market to. right yeah. we try to we try to absolutely uh, so here on the free night podcast we like to play this game Ramel yeah. started this this thing to where we play games with people and then uh, so we're gonna have a couple items yeah you're gonna give us uh, what you feel the price is. Oh, here we go. Because not every <laughs> on not, this spot. I just want to yeah. clarify, not everything is based off of market, is based off what people will pay for it. Right. So let me get this. And the name of the game is called The Price is Right. Okay. That's good. So am I answering in terms of like what what the shop would buy it for or what I would price it for as a shop? Both. Both. Yeah, you can do both. Okay. Both. I like that. Got I it. like that. Got it. And then we're gonna start with our uh our man JD Fresh here. JD Free. Go ahead and pass him the mic. Just uh, to preface, I usually I usually I usually use the internet. That's yeah. okay. okay. Uh, no, that's, I want well, you to use your. I want you to use your, but, your chest. Uh, let's just do it. Let's just do it off the dome. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dizzle for huh? mine, right? Because I asked him. Like I'm. I don't really wear much high beer anymore. Yeah. What do you mean? Good. Look at those shorts. But, but they were like. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, oh, I, I like to wear. Spot. I like to wear a lot of stuff that are from the homies. Yeah. Yeah. Like, support just to support. Like this is my this modern classic. This is my cousin Seti's yeah. uh, barbershop. Yeah. He came out with shit, so I'm wearing it. So. This is what I feel that's hype And none of these guys know what it is So okay. there you go. We're all full of surprises But yeah. imagine this brand new though Okay I already know what that is <laughs> I already know what that is Just you sentimental fuck Wow Okay here we go Ooh 
that F-word. is that classic F-word. That is classic. That is a that is classic, classic streetwear shirt. That is classic. It is. Shout out to the F-word. What does the back say? Kill him? Kill him with kindness. Kill him with kindness. In In three different fonts. Yeah. Made popular by cartoons. My brother-in-law, Fernando, is a fucking monster. So I will say we do have a younger demographic, so... This is something that we probably wouldn't buy for the shop. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's but, okay. Because young people suck. Yeah. But I will say, like, me and my business partners, we love looking through this kind of stuff. Yeah. Like, mm. like, I remember, you guys remember Rogue Status Tees? Absolutely. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. With the guns the literally cursive, all over. All over. Oh, my hey, all God. you got to do is swap out a dick with a Nike like, sign. Bro, I'm telling you, there has been multiple times where a family would come in and we have it on the rack. So we just, like, decided not to take in anything of, like, that. We it's don't even, hard. We don't even take in Yeezys anymore. Yeah. Because of the whole... To be fair. Wow. You know, we we kind of like to, you know, stay away from the controversy just to... So, yeah. You have to know... Hey, read the room and know your market, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah so, I mean, no, this, this, room, isn't, this, know isn't, your market. this isn't a shot to any stores that, that still take the product in is just our personal preference and you know I wore this to Disneyland and they made me w- t- turn it inside out before I go inside yeah, what see? that's like a high school dance see, that's, thing. that's the thing shout out to my sticker though. I don't, yeah. 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 I don't want to have any any beef with customers so no, no, yeah. you know, right. we, we nah. kind of like to keep it PG hold, hey, hold, hold on at all times best said by uh, Jackie Chan yeah, I don't want know. no trouble <laughs> <laughs> I don't want no trouble for Remember, sure. what you got oh, all right. Right. Yeah. Yeah. we'll take oh, turns here we'll take we go all right so Let's do it. So, here is how many did you bring, oh Ramel? Too. God, he brought he brought a banger. I already see the box and I already know what it is. Here it is. This here is the. You've asked me about these before. I'm pretty I have. sure these yeah. are trophy rooms. The trophy room. Jordy, <laughs> <laughs> trophy Jordan. room. Jordan drink on that let, me, let me let me uh, go ahead. Let me, please, let me, please, let me, please, please. Let me show this side. So there's two there's two versions of the shoe. So there's a sh- there's a version that came out. Um, I think it was exclusive to uh, Marcus Jordan, uh, Michael Jordan's son. He owned the, the one store. he backroomed. Yep. Yeah. They all backed it anyway. So they're all they're 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 very. It's like super infamous type of uh, deal with these because yeah. supposedly he backdoored a bunch of pairs. Correct. To uh, I mean, one thing friends I like and family, <laughs> friends and family, like people he knows, just so he can make the extra book before the release. Um, right. So he didn't have as many pairs as he said he would during the release in store. So it's a super like controversial type of shoe, um, and it's like a it's it's a super specific market because we don't have too many customers that cash out. Yeah, but step your game up, youngins. I know. Yeah, if anything, it's it's more so trade when it comes to the higher ticket items. Give me the value. How much how much trade can I get? What's how much store credit can I get? This is, this is one of the shoes where I'd have to ask you what what would you want to get for it? Because obviously that obviously obviously you would have a price and and I would need to make enough money for it. You know, it to be reasonable for me to. You gotta leave meat on, on the here. bone. Exactly. You gotta leave meat on the bone. So what would what would be your lowest number? I did, honestly, I did expect this <laughs> part of the game. I want uh, I want two thousand store credit. That's way too high. He he could only okay. probably more than I would want to post it for. Okay, I a want G, a thousand. Right? Okay, I want a, a thousand store credit, and then I want I want see, you to take me out to dinner. That's a little bit more reasonable. See, dinner Cause, though, because I know these are only. I want to say these are only in for like. They dropped too. They did drop. They dropped really hard, and that really hurt my. Why my nose on his <laughs> shoe? Yeah, <laughs> so I, I no, I haven't, I haven't, I haven't looked up the market on these because we we haven't had a pair come in in a minute. And this just, pair, this pair is, is I don't want to say it's missing because it, it's not from the from the store, but they the the special pair has this and it has um blue laces blue laces i had to get the china the and china for laces. sure the blue laces with them like makes compl- like all the difference and that's a weird thing in like sneaker culture now like if you're missing a yeah. shoe or OG the off whites if you don't have the zip tie then you're like you're you're off like a hundred two hundred three hundred sometimes even three four hundred dollars mm. okay what about um, this 750 and see i, and I I'm want you to them. door i'm dash. taking them at 750 for sure no and I want a uh, DoorDash. Uh, I want you to DoorDash me a meal. Yeah. For every week for a year. Hell no. no. no, no, no. Whoa. Hell okay, 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 okay. Three months. Three months. Three months. No. No. Uh, every. Oh, wait, wait. That's like seven fifty. That's like eighty it depends bucks. On, depends on how much you spend it. With though. a limit of fifty dollars. What was the last? What was the last amount you spent on DoorDash? Every, every week for three months. months? Damn. For three months. Yeah. See, I would probably consider nah. at, at <laughs> seven fifty. <laughs> It'd be a month. You'd, you'd probably a do month, a month. A month easily. Yeah. I would have did yeah. it. Yeah. Okay. For sure. No limit for a month. 
How much you do? $50 limit for a month Every week $75 Hell no For, for a that? month? That's three. That's three hundred dollars. No, 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 that's that's three hundred. That's a G already. That's a G. Sixty dollars. I'll take you up on the uh, on the date and the thousand dollars instead. Okay, but we're going to my shows. Damn. And he's taking food home. <laughs> <laughs> and you're bringing the Tupperware. <laughs> yeah. See, then then I'd have to pass. See? But Damn. this is like one of those shoes that's kind of risky to take. It's gonna sit. That's why. Either I, that. I'm I a mean, risky individual. I don't get. I don't get too many people looking for these. But it is a dope shoe. I will say. It is. It's a dope shoe. Did, do you like? Do, okay. How much did you spend on these? That's the question. Oh, Here's the thing. Good, okay, that's so a better question. Let's yeah. Just, let's just say. It's a better question. Oh, I hope you did a trade or something. I did. It was a tra- half okay, trade. Okay, there you go. Cash, he yeah. traded a lot of shit. The trade though. always I makes take, it. The, the, the boy math. Boy math. That's boy math, right yeah, there. Boy so money's math. already spent, right? Yeah, well, money's yeah. spent. So and you're damn near getting it for for free. Exactly. And the thing is with trades, right? Because yes. I am very sentimental with all my shoes, but with trades, I do this thing in my head where it's like, once I get it gone, don't think mm-hmm. about it again. Yeah. So like, I don't. I can't even remember what it was. Uh, but I do have an emotion tied to that transaction, and that is a little bit of regret. Yeah. So, okay. uh, so Maestro's, yeah, and seven fifty, yeah, yeah, for sure. One, one Maestro's dinner, for sure, and seven fifty. Would be my family. See, uh, wow, a lot. I have kids. Okay. Drive home. All right, all right, yeah, that's, that's, a lot. that's a lot. That's a lot. We're probably hitting the bar. We'll talk later. We'll talk later. We'll talk later. We're probably hitting the bar too. That's that's another tab. I don't drink yeah. around my kids. Just saying. Oh damn. But my kids, but my kids, no, my kids know good meat. Good for you. I'm very particular about shoes. I don't have a lot of shoes, but I, I, I looked at the store and I see things you have, and you have things that I would purchase that are like yeah. things around. So, Sketch. just you're not. Wow. You're, you're not. I know you're not a warrior see? fan. Yeah. But just to, just to see the, the well, thunder. This is, it's thunder. This is something that my, my partner Aegis would probably know a Aegis. little bit more about, but it's for sure a good display piece. It's something that we would put up in the store. I'd probably, if it was me and, and, and my partners weren't here, I'd probably give you 40 for it, 40 store that's credit, but solid. probably just store credit. Yeah, that's solid. Or if you want to trade for like a merch item, I'd probably trade you for But the cash me out of you like dub, right? Uh... For the 25, Warriors, yeah, 25. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, not, I'm not a Warriors fan. How much did I pay though? No, but the thing is, I have to say, you won that one simply because but of the you, fact that you it was won't quick. find this anywhere though. No, that's the thing. You probably won't even find this on eBay. Michael Jordan. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Keep shout that. out to Thunderfingers. Hey, Keep this was that. this was free, so it was 100 percent profit. Yeah. Yeah. Honestly, yeah. it's not a competition. Okay, anyways, we, we, we sell we sell the Warriors like giveaway tea sometimes. So, damn, we on giveaway our tea. Number two, Jeff. Number two, so. I am a rule story. breaker, and so if the first shirt was pushing the envelope, oh, here we go. Let's see Let what see. the second one let's is. See. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. It's just a big dick on there. That's another F word shirt. Yeah. Oh wow! Because I love it, bro. Yeah, no, that's wow. that is that was the first tee that the was fuck where did you, yeah. What store did you get this? This is from my cousin right here, oh, and it's got. He, and uh, and where did you get this? Brother in law. Yeah, oh, we. Uh, I, I helped my brother in law with that brand. Oh, yeah. Dope. yeah, yeah, yeah. That, so that <laughs> that one for sure. I know that won't be in the store. So Dave doesn't what? know that. So how Gus and I met. Yeah, we oh, both yeah. had we both had our own streetwear brand. This is like yeah, d- yeah. D- like DXE days, like when dope, everyone dope, had dope. a brand. When there was either either the the vendors with clothing or the vendors with shoes. Yeah, and me and Ramel were like the vendors with clothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah this yeah. pushes it. Like when you go out what, to eat what, and they see these, what it's stores like, used to carry? The, were there any stores in the Bay Area that used true. to carry this? True, true, true. Okay. true carry see, that's a very Premium true lens. upper plate. That's upper a very playground. true, yeah. true type shirt. Urban era. Yeah, true. Not yeah. urban area. That pushed the envelope though. But the same thing, like I mean, like I said, like uh, we appreciate all that stuff. Yeah. Like if anything, we we really pride ourselves into um, appreciating like older hey, Huff, bro. It's like, hype older to me. older I Huff like stuff. It. Dog, hey, I got a bin full of fucking size eights, dog. Older yeah. older yeah. Huff older Huff stuff, um, tees, fitteds. Um, even back to when like the hundreds was popping in the city. On um, posts, yeah. that's, 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 yeah. that's, that's what I kind of grew up on. The yeah. hundreds, yes, I mean, all those post hats. Because uh, obviously Huff was short lived, and you know it wasn't. It closed on on Sutter with the with the shoe store, and mm-hmm. you know what I mean. And, and we kind of we kind of it on socks. Like, yeah, we kind of pivoted they did, though. Pivoted into the hundreds and uh, diamond supply, etc. You know what I mean. So yeah, that's the kind of stuff that we we appreciate and we love seeing. So. 
Yeah, Bay Area streetwear was a little different during that. Super different. It so was different. What, super different. What it is now, because it was very regional. Yeah. Shout out to yeah. Homebrew. It was, was our pride. Yeah. yeah. Gold, free gold watch. Free, free gold watch. Oh, wow. Free gold watch. With the free big gold. tags. The, the big tags. Big, yeah. big long tags. We, we still get those seasons sometimes. Dude, free gold watch. Fully laced, John. Fully laced. Shout out to Fully laced, man. Love you, John B. Love you, John. Yes, sir. Love John. Go Crusaders. That's the homie. Yeah, that's number the homie. Romel, right. number two. Oh, here we go. He in a pair of shoes? Not the pair of shoes. I'm, I'm not going to look. I'm not going to look this time. I looked the first time. Don't look, okay? Yeah. So this is a special one to me. This oh, is a size silver box. 10 and a half silver box. It's a high box. already. I already know. It's a high. With the lace bag still attached. Wow. And that I think is. I know what these are. Yes. Are they brand new? Yeah. Oh, my God. You know what's crazy? I remember Romel bringing me. The uh, the red cement low supreme dunk SBs. Me? Do you remember that? Uh, that was from. Yes. You remember bringing bring uh, me those, right? Yeah, but the, I told you before, like I'm just it's, supposed. It's I'm, crazy because I'm just trying to you know I have to because get rid of that the in my mind. the price that Romel told me that he wanted back then was ridiculous. And mind you, this was before the dunk SBs kind of like. Had a rose, resurgence, yeah. rose in popularity again. Okay, shout out to drug. Shout, <laughs> shout, shout out to Travis Scott. Cause you, I remember you pulled up with Marvin. Yeah, that's right. Shout out to Marvin, dude. Marvin actually. Marvin has some, out. Sh- has some shit. He has some shit. Shout out to the single life. Yeah. Shout oh out yeah. Wait, so Marvin. he was he, when he was. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. So uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. so tell me, sir, uh, with this, uh, look at that toe box. Wow. Okay. Feel free to touch it. Wow. I'm gonna tell you the. Like I'm gonna tell up. you that I'm gonna tell you as if you were like just a random customer. You know what I mean? Customer. <laughs> like I would love to have this in my store, but the kids don't appreciate these. Bro, anymore. you just gave me the "it's not you, it's me." No, and you're it's, breaking up with me, I dog. Mean, it's a, it's a, a. Trust me, it's a great shoe, but we tell customers like, like I just don't want it to fall apart on a customer too. That's true. Because you, know you don't know, you, you don't have like any history with the on the shoes. Like yeah. I don't know, if, I don't know if the, the camera can pick up, but we have some shoes back here that are like that are just destroyed from Crumbly. the same era. Really? Yeah, we just don't like. We have we have Heinekens back here. Oh yeah, that's right. Can, you got you have a, a glass. Case. We have a we have a, we have a case back here of, of shoes that have just you know I are, got a are in graveyard mode. So so graveyard those hot <laughs> ones are those the the closest one no, the first no, no. release. This is the this is the retro. Oh okay. Yeah, they came out again in 2021, 2022. Damn it, you have the uh, you have the Agassi twos. What would you what would you mm-hmm. price these at though? If you were to take them in, they're brand new, right? Yeah. I mean, if you were to take those in, easily over two k price tag. Four k. Okay, how about this? I'll, we'll do. Because they're brand new, bro. Five hundred. You don't see. Five hundred. <laughs> and then see negotiating. I get to work in your store, but anything oh. I sell is commission, and I get all of that. <laughs> As profit He's not a hard uh, worker I mean how long Are you gonna wear for That's the thing Six months Every day No week. Saturdays And no Fridays No Saturdays oh, That's and tough Fridays. <laughs> Okay how about this That's tough So what Wednesday Thursday That's it Wednesday <laughs> Thursday Okay but only Okay hold on Only during Christmas Oh man No Cause those are gonna sit <laughs> 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 yeah, so, see, that's the thing. Like, if anything, a customer will come in to trade more than anything. For yeah, sure. I just appreciate the fact that you're actually thinking, thinking about, about it. Yeah, you, I mean, you're putting me on the spot, so I, I gotta, I gotta actually. A kid's dad know. will buy it before a kid will. Probably, and, and yeah, that's fast. Believe it or not, like kid a, lot, a lot of a lot of these a lot of these SBs like that we used to collect growing up are still brand new, and it, it, it's unfortunate because. You're kind of just wasting money at this point, you know. You got to sell them as soon as possible. Yeah, but it's true. <laughs> the better spot would be true. Would, just, would be eBay for sure. Because I uh, I remember. I shout out this to is a, a, this is a high ticket. Shout out to uh, uh, eBay Authentic. Shout out yeah. to my girl Ev. This is a high ticket for sure. Yeah, shout out to my boy Carlos uh, Lucera. I, I worked with him at St. Louis Hospital. I got him into sneakers, and he's I'm like, s- he's like, hey, I got these for five hundred. Do you want these for five hundred? I was like, yeah. Yeah. Damn. These? Yeah. Holy shit. But how, what, what year was that? That's crazy. Uh, this is like 2008, 2009. Oh, okay. Yeah. That that, that makes sense. Yeah. That makes All right. Sense. And this is my last thing. Oh, oh my God. Oh, I guess knows how to fuck <laughs> wow. a pander, let's, let, let, let's show. That's dope, bro. 
this is like how many ma- how many maestro dinners? This is this is one of these items that I I mean obviously you. you this is like this is a priceless item. See, like I we just, we we rarely come across things like this. We used to have a Chucky doll. Shut the fuck up, guys. <laughs> <laughs> this guy, See, look at him. I mean look your I mean your shoes as well. Don't do that, Daniel. Your, you your touched shoes this box well. more than you touched I my shoes. I will say your <laughs> shoes are way more expensive pricier than this. Yeah, but the sentimental value it it could it could vary. You know what I mean? You know what it is? It's like in rom coms. This is like the the super hot girl, and this is the hot girl with this glasses. This is dope, on, though. This is dope. Yeah, don't ever dope. sell this, man. No, keep it. Don't, don't you ever change? I, I couldn't even. I couldn't even put a price on it because. How many mics are there? Because look, look, pennies it, are pennies are still coming out to this day. Yes. Like phone posits are coming out. Like yes. Literally week yeah. after week for yeah. the past like what two months? Besides Jays, those are my second favorite basketball shoes. Yeah. All, everything penny. What? Yes. Besides Jays. Basketball shoe for me. I'm talking about yeah, what yeah, I that's, like. That's good. That's good. I'm talking about good. what I like. I don't when, care what you like. You like paying a lot of money for <laughs> for steak dinners and shit to get I these know, shoes that you're I never like gonna other wear. Other people pay. Yeah, money true. For money. See, I have I have I have a sentimental value with, when it comes to pennies too. Because when I worked at Nike, that's when like the one cents came out. One mm-hmm. cents ago, mm-hmm. and oh, the, the, penny, the penny fives I believe came mm-hmm. out, and those were my hoop shoes like religiously. Like those were my hoop shoes. So, I have I have a love hate relationship with foam posits because they look dope. Oh, obviously, they're like they're heavy. Yeah. They look dope on other people, but when I wear them and look down, like it's just not me. I would never ball. That's so dope. Does it? Does it? Does it talk? Does it speak? No, I don't know. It's 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 still in the box. I haven't. I haven't cracked it. Okay, I don't. So, I don't know if this is the one that, that talks, but it's actually the there. There is sure. one that talks. That's there a is lot, one that talks. Th- that's a the lot huge bigger. One. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But I don't know if the the, the little ones do. You know. But so, you guys, you guys done making out over there. <laughs> there's, <laughs> there's a lot. There's a lot of these you see online, but that it's, sick, it's just a figure, but it's not in the box. Yeah, that's dope. And then, oh yeah, yeah. But then the one that's that dope. talks, that's the one. I yeah, think of Tyra Banks when I think of that doll right there. I think of the. I think of the commercial one. Tyra Banks was always in those commercials. Oh, remember? Yeah. yeah, I remember seeing something. I like think that. of the Black Street, com- uh, the Black Street, and uh, Dr. Dre oh, music video. No diggity, because oh, he was Little Penny was in that video. Do you guys throw in clips during these during these podcasts? I what? mean, we can. It just takes a little there bit go. harder. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. No doubt, yo. So go. I have to say, Gus batted a thousand percent on that. No, your audience. Were you guys were you guys like competing? We oh, always who, do. Okay. okay. <laughs> I wasn't trying. To it's a, it's a, it's a close. It's yeah. a very close competition. Yeah, yeah. I don't make very it close. Don't try to do that. Very close it. competition. You I, brought the, you brought the, you brought the bangers though. Yeah, you Gus, go. Gus did bring up a good question, and I want to ask actually the three of you, mm. the Mount Rushmore of player, of basketball player shoes. Give me your top four. Obviously I mean, are Jordan. we are we including Jordan though? Are you saying are you saying collection or a particular shoe? Just the best model. So, like for example, like Iversons, right? Mm. Iverson, okay, yeah. Iverson. Since I already said two of mine, so it's gonna be it's gonna be Jordan. It's gonna be Penny. Uh, are you talking about? And um, you need some more. I'm two uh more. Oh, oh two more. Yeah, four. Um, say Jordan. I say Penny. Uh. I'm a uh, like I grew up in the '90s, yeah. so I I have a love for Grand Hills, okay. yeah, like Fila yes. Fila Grand Hills. Okay, that's you know I'm, I'm a little different that way. And then um, uh, four spot uh, number four. Uh, I can't even I can't even give one right now. Um, where do the Jason kids sit on yours? Damn, does, did Jason Kidd have an official line though? It wasn't his shoe. He had the he Zoom just had, Air. He just, yeah, he just he just had, he just had he didn't have a signature. He had some flights. What about have his name on? What about Pippin's? Pippin's mm, did. Yeah, Pippin yeah. too. Pippin, I don't think Pippin had his own signature, but he, he had he the did. up tempos. It just didn't have his name on it. He, he had, had the one that had that cl- that, that zigzag Pippin shit on the side. Pippin one, twos, and threes. Oh, there you go. Yeah, yeah he did. Um, then I would have to have to throw in Pippin's in the mix. Okay, that's a good. That's a good mix. That's a good mix. Daniel, please. Okay, so we're not counting Jordans, right? No, you can't. Jordan's, can't okay, sure. Jordan's obviously number one. Two, Kobe's for sure. <sighs> see, that was different Kobe's? For me. Yeah, see, it's a, it's a whole age it's thing, age thing right? It's a whole yeah. age thing. Yeah, Kobe's for me. Yeah. I mean, I mean, obviously, Kobe had his name on it, but... Um, and the whole else? Proton thing? I don't know. And then, and then Penny's. Oh, we, we're doing another one after that. No, that's good. Three. Okay, Penny's. So that's three. Give me Penny's. Four. Penny's after. Uh, Penny's. I grew up in a in a... In a in a weird era like 2012 2013 where people were rocking like basketball shoes with like their cargo shorts and like pants you know what i mean Absolutely. so i grew up i grew up in like the kd4 era oh, oh um, yeah 
So the Ann Pearl era, the Aunt Pearls, um, the undefeated ones, the undefeated, the Rogue, the Rogue Green ones. Those are the yeah, Rogue those Greens. Are kind of, oh yeah, those um, ones. The year, the year of the dragons. Yeah. Um, so for right? sure, KD, uh, either KD or Kyrie. It's a, it's a, it's a toss up because Kyrie Kyrie's back. Oh, yeah. Like yeah. Kyrie, yeah. Kyrie was like street Kyrie, ball yeah, type. Kyrie yeah, yeah. used to be the low cut, the high cut, but they were always at a affordable price. That's mm. what I, I, I loved about the Kyrie's because that's Kyrie's a good four, dude. You know? That's yeah. a good four. Yeah. Just. You guys don't know my number one? Barkley. Obviously, Barkley. Yeah, Barkley's you're a Barkley number one for dude. me. Oh, uh, yeah. Jordan. Yeah. Yep. Penny. Ooh. Pippen. That's four. Oh, five. Uh, there's a fifth. That was just. No, there's only four. Oh, four. four. Uh, there was a fifth. I was thinking. Uh, Mm, was Dennis fit. Rodman, the worms. I got <laughs> they were worms though, bro. And, and destruct. <laughs> and destruct. <laughs> you may, oh, LeBron. LeBron. But yeah. only I was I never a LeBron shoe fan. Yeah. I was uh two for sure. Because those are the first laser cut shoes Damn. ever that Nike made. The for LeBron me, shoes. I, I didn't like the LeBrons. I didn't like the LeBrons up until Court like Worms? this. Let me guess until he was on the Lakers. No, 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 no not even. After after the four. After, not even done. Fours were too bulky and heavy. Fours were too heavy. But uh, threes were my favorite. Everything yeah. after that was cool for the LeBrons. Yeah. Yeah. For South me. South Beaches. South Beaches. Jordan. Right? Mm-hmm. That's everyone. Iverson. It's given. Iverson? Oh, oh, Iverson. Was really. The it, questions. Two? Just just the questions though, I not hate, the answers. I hate it. Oh, the answers, no, the that's like that's anything, right? No, that's for sure answers. Yeah. That's included. That's <sighs> I I could stop that one. I would one. have to say Pippins. Yeah, I like Pippins. And the Paytons. The gloves, oh, yeah. Yeah. only that the gloves. Was, that was a one. In, that was only a I one and done. Wasn't it? Gloves, that shit is yeah. sick. He had, yeah. he had two. He had two gloves. He? he has one that was. He had yeah, but if if was like we had him. wide feet, it was hard to zip those up. Is it? I never yeah, had I them. Always zip them up. Them. A lot of yeah. people back then, uh, when Didn't they when them. they came out with them again, like when they came out with the organ yeah. pins, yeah, people would rock them, not zip. Like yeah. obviously, I just for that looks so sick, not zip, dude. But if someone cut their bricks. They are bricks. Yeah. I have the soul collector yeah. ones, and those are bricks. <laughs> it's like you're walking. It's, it's like you're walking yeah. with oh, snowshoes. Yeah, yeah, they're heavy. <laughs> I'm surprised nobody said the Rashid Wallace Air Force ones. <laughs> that was a one and done. Yeah. Yeah. Air yeah. sheets. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I still, still caught those. Yeah, dude. dude what I about the, those? What about the camps, oh. bro? No love for camps. No kamikazes. Right here, she's. These are not the highs, but these are she's nonetheless. <laughs> What's your, those are still one what's your favorite Air Force? This is like a this is like a six Y. So that's, that's what's your favorite Air Force One? Because you're of, you're of that era. Oh my! What's gosh, your favorite Air Force One? Oh my God, we're going there. So lunars. Everyone for sure. go around. Everyone right, go around. Right. Favorite Air Forces? Yeah, linens. Uh, linens have to be my number one. Lunars. Linens. Linens. I was just okay. doing one of these. The, the khaki. The khaki and pink. One. I feel it. Wow. I feel it. That's my favorite. That that's your number one. That or uh, or the stash. Lows, those are nice. Not the highs. Oh, stash lows. I like the stash. Stash lows. Yeah, uh, yeah. Mine were the uh, maze lasers. Ooh, maze, maze lasers. lasers. So it had laser etching, like your like those dunks on top. Yeah, and it, and it was uh it, it was graph all the way around, and the back Damn. had a spray can. There was only two. Uh, I seen it at Nike Town in uh in L.A. No, no, sorry, in Vegas. I bought it. Um, I didn't even win, but I wanted to buy something because I wanted to leave Vegas or something. I lost yeah. all my money, so I bought those. <laughs> and I and I called because they only got one size per per store. So I called the Frisco one, put it on hold for myself. Flew back home that night because they put it on hold. They kept it at the end of the night. I went to Nike Town the next morning and it was still there. So I had, Damn. I have two pairs of those. Yeah, to this day. Holy. Yeah. Yeah, is one maze up? lasers. Wow. They're all brown. Good, just clean as fuck. Twenty five hundred oh, made. Shit. Well, I would like to say the Philippine Air Force ones, but before that, because we're local and grew up Giants fans, man, it was always the first Halloweens. Oh yeah, oh, I can't. Those are like the ones that fear like a Giants fan. The and first Halloween is that the split patent leather ones? No, it's all black with the green gum sole. Oh, with the orange gum sole and then the skeleton oh, stitching at the, the back. The split one was crazy to oh, see. Oh, that one was crazy. Yeah, 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 it's all sure. black. Yeah, I couldn't do it. Yeah, put that up with a fantastic force. Damn. <laughs> Dope. I don't think I've ever seen those. First Halloween is the, the split, the Scarface ones are the second. Invisible okay. women? <laughs> Invisible women? Oh, no. Yo. Like, if you had white feet, your toes so, weren't even not, reaching. It's not the, even the toe the thing, it's the so fogging up. Yeah. Fogging up. Yeah. And, and when it when it Hot. fogs up yellow, too, that's Duh. the worst. And that's why I could never wear those clots. I have the first releases have the clots, of those, yeah. and I can't put them on because. 
I remember people had the Xbox. My toes, Xbox yeah. too, same deal. Xbox too, same thing, yeah. yeah. Oh, even though Supreme 97, was it 97s, 98s or something, where they it was like silver, but you, you could see through. Yeah. Anyways, yeah. for me, Safaris. <laughs> Safari Air Force Ones. Safari Air Force Ones. Damn, you got I feel it. Like orange, black with a little gray in the... I'm always partial to orange or black. I miss that, those that's times, always going to be a thing for me. Yeah, yeah it's kind of like a default. Yeah. Like the it flash, is. flash SBs. Yeah. yeah. Not even SBs, yeah. but flash all dunks. Right. Question. Sorry, Jen. I see you're getting bored with all the sneaker talk. <laughs> Favorite huff shoe that was released? Can I go first? Of course. Gold Diggers. You that's son it. of a gun. Because Gold I, Diggers is such a, like, <sighs> obviously, it's such an iconic. It is that. Then that's my era, though, right? It's, it's kind of like that, that cross is. trainer kind of sees. Yeah. And then how they they brought that back. No one was no one was paying attention to cross trainers like that. Yeah. 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 You yeah. know what I mean? True. Yeah. Love I that. grew up on what you got. Oh, cur- yeah. Current ninety Air Max Air Maxes. I don't know the Huff came out with a pair of those. Oh, the blue ones. Yeah, the blue ones. Yeah, yeah the blue, the blue, with the, blue yeah. with the white and yeah. gray. I asked Anthony to send me one something of his. Like by the way, gold yeah, diggers. Yeah, yeah, it was like a, with that. With yeah, something like either that or I mean, obviously the Huff SBs. I was gonna say that Huff SB highs. Oh shit, Jen, grab the mic. What's up, oh, Jen? See? What you got, Jen? What you got? Can I go next? Please. Oh, what yeah. the? F- yes. <laughs> Let's hear it. Uh, Adidas Barry McGee. I don't know if you guys oh. remember that one, but Barry McGee came out with a uh, uh, Adidas with Huff? early, early on. So yeah, with her. Oh, is that the Ray Fong one? Shh. Yeah, Ray. Ray Fong. Yeah, the uh, the brown and gold. Yeah, I forgot all about the superstars. Think- superstars, right? Superstars. Yeah. yeah, I think so. What about you, Justin? Justin. I'm thinking JD. Quakes, right? Quakes. Yeah, yeah. Quakes. I, Quakes. I love the neon green Air Forces. Black with neon green with the matching hat. You do look like a black line. Air Force wearer type guy. <laughs> I do that. was like that was the thing back then, bro. A hundred bucks for fucking Air Force Ones and yeah. just trying to get every special probably, occasion. Probably ninety, because ninety. I remember Air Forces were ninety for a cool minute. Yeah, bro. That was ninety dollars. Bro, Tax. Tax. St. Patty's Day. Tax. I love all that. No, Fear no. of Gods. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah so. all of them. I was yeah. late to all that, yeah. dude. It was such a fucking vibe back then. Oh yeah, uh-huh. camping for oh, yeah. like. I remember when I would drive by and see people camping for shoes like after the club. I'm like, damn, they're dedicated. Yeah, I mean, are. even even with the newer Huff. I mean, the Huff rollout for the Huff SF pair, and then the Huff New York pair, and then the Huff Friends and Family pair of the Dunk. Lows, mm. SBs, like the family. The, dude, the friends and family is not bad with the callback. Even to even me. even though the 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 SB, the dunk that they did isn't. I mean, the the tongue wasn't padded. No, it wasn't. It's like that, uh, not padded. Uh, it's, it's a lot different yeah, now. Yeah, Pro B shit. Right? I was butthurt. I didn't Damn, get you're that. a dunk general release type. Pretty you know much. I mean? But I mean, no shot, no shot to have. Tearaway, is tough. Or recipes, oh, yeah. hub. for sure. Recipes, yeah, bro, yeah, bro, recipe, recipes, hub. Recipes, hub. Recipes, hub. Fits. A lot of great times. And fits. Yeah, man. Shout to fits. Fits was a usual for us too. Shout to Roy, man. Rest in peace, Roy, man. Hell yeah, yeah. Roy Boy, yeah. I'm just fits. You guys got any favorite huff? Did, did you have a Huff pair? Yeah, did you have a favorite? Yeah, mine was the uh, oh. SBs. Oh, okay, oh, okay. Yeah. okay. Basic. My bad. <laughs> my bad, my bad. All right, Gus, do you have a favorite fitted? Uh, also, interesting fact, Gus didn't have any Huff fitteds until he met me. So, my favorite then is the first Huff hat that Ramel gave me, which is the Basquiat. Oh, man, that's wild. It's because it's the first one that I ever had because I was the guy that, that did not want to be in, 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 in no in an H hat in the club because oh. everyone had it everyone yeah. had an H hat everyone had a diamond shirt yeah that was like the era and now that was it that J Billion respectable yeah I was, J I, Billion shout, shout, shout out to out J he's, 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 he's the homie that's the homie Billy the Beast that's yeah. the homie so I, I I was trying to be not that but I I respected that for what it was like it was it was a dope time like Such and time. if I didn't like I appreciate it now more from that was such a, like a wave that into like the whole black scale and then yeah. diamond and and then just all the all the local street brands as far as like the San Francisco like Bay Area ones like coming together. I, I thought that was dope. Very dope. Yeah. yeah. So my favorite one is the, the the first one I ever got was from Ramel, which is a Basquiat. It's really loud though. It's black and white, but there's a lot going on, and you can only wear that with certain shit. So yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mine, mine is pretty loud too. I had uh, my favorite is the Huff the Galaxies. Fitted the black oh. one. That one's pretty loud. Not with the multicolored. It's the multicolored. That's oh. what. That's the one that's supposed to pair with the with the phones, with right? The, with all the neon, with all the highlighter colors. With the uh, with the under uh, brim too, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh. That was dope. Dog. But it was super loud, obviously. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. that was the thing, though, right? It was the yeah. time, bro. Yeah. I mean, I had to buy it on a resale because 
we were at school during those lineups. So, yeah. <laughs> oh, hey, shout out to education, bro. Yeah. Wait, yeah. Yeah. shout out to making I mean, choices in life. Yeah. To go from Daily City to like the city back then was like a mission. Yeah, like you didn't know how to work Bart. Like you, you had to take Muni. You had to take Muni. You had to take. You had to take Bart. You had to walk up the hill. You had to walk up Sutter and just line up for hours and respectfully yeah. not get jacked on the way back home. Back then Best. it wasn't. It wasn't that bad, but you know. Well, what size? The, what size the, you wear? Um, back then I was I was a three. I, I float between a three eight and a one half. Three so. pro. So you're so. So I had a popular. I was super popular. Size. <laughs> you fight yes, for that pair. You but then again, yeah, size. exactly. There was yeah. so many. There there wasn't so many, but I, everyone a line ahead of me was, had that size. So, dude, Gus and I wear a size eight. You know how shout hard it is to, to get a size eight, Man, dog. I can't imagine. Yo, shout yeah. out to Bruce Bochi. He's a thinker, dog. <laughs> and oh, he, he had a big. He had a big. He had a big. Uh, <laughs> Yo, it was like he's an a eight three four. <laughs> Damn, bald, bro, bald. No way. He's a big. He's, he's a thinker. That's crazy. Justin, yeah, what's, yes. what, what's your favorite hat? Did you say it to me? No, it's crazy because I, I, like I said, Quakes, right? Yeah. And I have the hat, but I never wore it. I would just find, I would go to Sports City and find the matching Shout Giants to Don hat. Sports City that matches the shoes. Yeah. 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 All the time, like, because yeah. to me, it's like, okay, I, I got the shoes. I spent, I invested my time, yeah. like camping overnight. And then I could just go that right after that to Ceremony and go to Sports City and put on my my shower cap. And yeah, <laughs> my yeah, hat yeah. And when Ceremony was know? outside, they, they had any they had any hat to go with your fit. Yeah, yeah. they made yeah, that yeah. happen. That, for you. That's yeah. That Shout was, out to Dawn, man. That was mine. And like, uh, I mean, like, of course, like I, I respect Huff and never hate on the hats. Those all hats are sick. Yeah, but it was like black scale too, like. They never made my size. And it was a, it, it was wasn't a, even new era at first. It was, it was a like scare brand, thing. yeah. So like when two, X, two X, two yeah. X Slim was like the biggest uh, two X Slim, the biggest black a scale T shirt. I can't fit slim that. Thing. You know, like no matter how dope I thought it would, it looks. It's like I could never put it on. It That's was, a Philippine size. My nipples would be showing. Two X Slim. My nipples would show. I can't back out with that. Yeah, I will say the craziest um huff hats used to be like the three the all over 3m ones because oh, yeah, you would yeah, look yeah. so oh, crazy yeah all oh, like the, the ones with the polka dots crazy you know not even just that just the full 3m i remember they had four oh 3Ms, i have those bro. i have those like they have the white i mean now they're probably like of course peeling you do. And crap. Yeah, no, that was yeah. like, like you know the, i had the ones with the pe- the leather like they have the alley the leather the, bill yeah, yeah. The, all those are cracking all out too peeling, peeling off, everything dude. yeah yeah <laughs> mine has to be Wise investment there, gentlemen. <laughs> I used to, you know what? Like, I have, I have, like, you've seen it. I have, like, uh, yeah. so many hats, but yeah. my hair is dope right now. Yeah. Shout out to Shout Natural out to your Curls. Hairdresser. Shout out to Hairdresser. Shout out to Butch. He's my barber. Shout out to, to Butch. Shout out to the barbers. Mine, it has to be the Huff Hawaiian Punch. Mm, that was I don't a, even remember that. That was a one. Mm. They only had 50 of those, and I paid a hundred bucks for mine. There was for sure eight. always more than what they said they Probably. were. Probably sure. back door. You know, they, they had the hell the homie like, sizes. Shout out to all the workers. Got to get their shout out all the fifteen twenty huff employees. That, you know exactly. Yeah. Shout out to Sh- Ron. Yeah. Yeah. Shout out to the set. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, what's up, what's up, Jan? All right, I wanted to turn it around a little bit. Like, what, uh, what do you think uh, is a shoe that's like in last place uh, for you? Last place, Jan. You sneaky devil. <laughs> I mean, are we talking like old, new, just all in all? L- last place in re- reference to what he would what he would buy for the store or his. I mean, what I, he likes. I would never wear the the big red boot if you call that the, a, a shoe. A those are, what are those? Oh. The Ultramans? No, no, those are called the Astro Boys. The Astro yeah, Boys. The Astro yeah, Astro Boys. I, I mean, I, I wouldn't. That wanna, whole brand is just like it's it's just yeah, seems I mean, like it, a it's troll. a meme. It's a yeah. very meme brand. Mitchy. I mean, yeah, I probably yeah. wouldn't wear any of those. Yeah. You know, but you know, I've I've had that question before, but it's always hard for me to answer because everyone likes. What about from an actual like brand? That's like, you know, like a, a real brand. <laughs> Sorry, mm. that's like a brand. <laughs> brand. Man, I don't know. I don't know if I have. I mean, I don't. I, I don't like to put down anything. So, oh, I would have personally. I'll go first. Sambas. Yeah. Yeah, I think uh, Sambas have some really good colorways though. I had my time with Sambas and that was like right after high school, but yeah. uh, I can't really fuck with them right now. They're really too like thin Sambas. It's all personal they're, they're pretty yeah. flat too. Well, so. they also came back into light because of the Jenners and, and I'm yeah, not really yeah, they're, with they're, they're soccer shoes too, so like you can't really like you can't mm. really put a knock on that cuz True. I don't there's, play a, there's a customer for everything, so. That's true. See, look, it's like a true yeah. business. A question, yeah. uh, so, Jan said the Generic. worst, but you had a moment with them. That means you respect them there at one go. point. See? So, 
what's one that you just can't ever have or not even try on or look at or pick up is there a shoe that i can't think of one i don't know why that i would not even pick up like if you see this story you, you don't even want to look at it like mm, probably it's hard probably it's hard a team jordan or something but okay and i wanted to ask this as a shoe guy right like the the whole like if it's not a jordan it's not a michael jordan shoe it's kind of like eh. to me anything past 15 um but but uh 20s are dope damn man, 16s man. are dope yeah, I'm, I'm, spoken like a true youngin though that's like I some young uh, shit I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a old head so you know I, yeah, I, 20s, I, though, 20s, 20s, I stay though. in my no, lane 20s too so like yeah. what is one team Jordan shoe that's that's not like a like a Chris Paul or like a that's dope that yeah that, trunners dog Trunners are dope. Trunners all day, bro. Is, is that yours? Yeah, Trunners. Well, I have a pair yours? of Trunners. My dad had a pair of Trunners. No. I always say Trunners too. Trunners, what's yours? I love the like Trunners. Trunners. Like one that we love. Justin, it was your, yeah, that, that's your that's your like oh, Jordan shoe because you know, ju- like Jumpman's always get like that wah of it. But shout, <laughs> shout out to you know, um, some dub shout out to uh, my boy Bert, man. I, I, I love say you, Bert. N- not now. <laughs> dub zeros too. It, in the moment, dope, dub dope. zeros because the laser cut was hot right there. I had the first color. It was and you know it was a mix of thirteen with. The but that's the Jordan shoe. This though. was like this was yeah. like Jordan was like shoe, peak, wasn't it? it was, this was like yeah. peak. Uh, damn, what website was it where they had the pick your oh, shoe? Pick your shoe. Yeah, I remember pick your shoes. Pick your shoes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow, Every I colorway does. Well, yes. yes. Pick your shoes. I never knew if it was a scam or not. Like that's that true. that website because yeah. it, it looked kind of fishy. Some of them like it looked kind of fishy. I don't want to say B grades, but like mental kicks. No, I didn't have you ever heard of mental kicks? I mean, I might have. You could go like, there right now, but they're like B grade Jordans and, and Nikes. This like, is when I was yeah, exposed to like pump. to like the world of like fakes and like the the SpongeBob on the side of the, oh, the Dub Zero. Yeah. 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 Oh my God! What a time! Mine would be Quick Strike, either Quick Strike or the Strongs, because. Oh. I don't even care about all that. I love that. that. Ray Allen wore those. That's yeah, Ray. Yeah. Uh, it was uh, Eddie Eddie Jones wore the quick strike. Yes, and he was a yes. Laker. Eddie and that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and Vin Baker wore the strong. And Vin Baker. Yep. But it yep. wasn't it wasn't their shoe, but they were like part of like that's the, when like Jordan, Jordan was building sub, like sub brand their army. Yeah. Jordan, yeah, it was like yeah. I, don't know, I was like after time. that they were kind of like Wah. but the, what a time. Yeah, what a time. time to be alive. What a time, Jan. Do you have any last words for today as we wrap up this pod? I love this episode. This is dope. <laughs> <laughs> we're, just, we're just talking shit. I'm not that. I'm not that I'm, I mean, obviously, I'm, I, I said it earlier today. I'm 30, but I was immersed into this before I even had a debit credit card. You know what I mean? Like, I was just browsing like as a kid. So this is dope. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I wanted to say thank you. Nice to meet you. And um, yeah. I feel very much at home here. Yeah. yeah. And I love what, you know, the uh, the vibe that you have in the whole thank store. You. Thank yeah. you. Thank I, you. Thank I, you. I, I kind of feel like we're at uh, our studio because it's it's Similar. like it's like we have Gus's uh, shoes and like uh, clothes like, uh, like in the intimate. background. This is, yeah, this, you is, know, and, this uh, is home. This is, that, that's, you know, that's the main We have uh, Simpsons. And uh, Jordan up there. Yeah, I don't know if the camera can pick up, but we have, but, we have a couple visuals. I know you guys have that that little. Yeah. Cutout, so. Yeah. So. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, man. Thank um, you. Thank you, guys. JD Fresh. JD. Freaky, freaky. I just want to say, uh, right on, bro, for the hospitality. Oh, yeah, it's good course. meeting you. It's my first time here. Yeah. And like we were chopping it up before, and I was like talking about how like I just retired off. I. You say you're retired off buying shoes, but you never, never leave. Never happens. And I was telling you like like. Shoes are a drug. It is. And it I just want to say, Gateway. some <laughs> drugs are cool. <laughs> Trust me, I've, I've, I've had, I've had like, yeah. ten, I've had ten plus moments in my life where I'm like, man, I'm done with shoes. To so just to be like, you know, just to own a business and just to, you know, be surrounded by this, literally like a lot of my day. So, Jan yeah, much a love, back. respect, bro, Good, respect. Jan? Yeah, Jan asked for a piece coming. Let's go. Can we have you sign the table? Oh yeah, absolutely. Like yeah. while. Um, while I, shooting, I I noticed okay. no one signed in the middle, so I'm not going to sign. Oh the yeah, middle, do you have a marker by any chance? I did. Oh, good oh, shit. So, uh, Ramel. So, my guy, Daniel. Thank you. It's been a long thank time you. coming. Yeah. And to close the show, I have two quotes for you. Oh, let's hear. Let me hear before I sign. <clears throat> First one is the most humble dude I know. Always leads with purpose and good intention with family, friends, and also business. Has never been hesitant to lend a helping hand and puts his family first always. 
Appreciate you. Do you know what that is? <coughs> no. I am a little drunk mm. and I didn't save his name, but last name Buena. And he shot that picture of you in your 49er jacket. That's your cousin. Oh, but it's true. That's my homie Angelo. Right. That's, the, that's Angelo. the homie cousin. That's my closest. That's like my, confidant. That's, that's the that's the boy. Second quote is yeah. I have a ton of great memories. It's hard to pick an absolute favorite, but my favorite memories oh, in general are when he asked me if I want to tag along on whatever errands he he's doing. The amount of trips we made together to Taco Bell, McDonald's, oh Target, Jack in the Box, exactly Ceremony, etc., are endless. Oh, sister. Me and Derek would tag along ever since Daniel got his license, and we still do this to this day. Yeah, it's very rare that Daniel goes to run errands himself yeah. as he'd always want us to accompany him it's my favorite memory because it reminds me most of my childhood makes me happy that my brothers and i still share the same bond and are just as close if not even closer than love before that. love that and i think shout out my sister shout out to your I sister i love that yeah. my sister yeah i'm, I'm just thankful <clears throat> we're all close in age so you know they come to me and and i go to them always so and i think it's very consistent with your journey yeah you with archived sf with ages and mark yeah never running an errand by yourself <coughs> you're creating these memories mm -hmm. and the future and it's fucking beautiful thank you i have to say malcolm gladwell in his book outliers pointing out he used the beatles and ex as an example where they had ten thousand hours of practice mm -hmm. after that they took over the world yeah thank you bro. see what's fucking next for you my thank guy you, thank you thank you i appreciate y'all I appreciate y'all. Y'all will never understand. This is, this means a lot. This is my third podcast, but you know this is a good one. <laughs> this was a great one. <laughs> I got to say. I got a couple. Okay. Oh, oh, here we go. Let's go. This is a uh, solid guy. Always helpful. All about his business. This is Bernie Reyes. Shout out to Burn. 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 Burniness. Bernie Reyes. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. Yes. Um, uh, Danielle D. Steez is a trendsetter who's redefining style with his uh, Steezy sense and in it. <clears throat> sorry. I got a frog in my throat. And if approach to retail, uh, he's not just selling clothes. He's shaping the future generations to come, all while putting on for the SFC. Respect. Darren Baran. Darren. Darren Rocks. The homie. Daughter Rocks. Uh, um, I wouldn't be able to run the store the same way without him. Uh, can can ask for a better uh, partner, brother. Oh, trying to make me cry? Yeah. Before, <laughs> before the store, I spent some time thinking of who would be the uh, who would be the perfect partner, and I didn't hesitate when he came when he came to mind. Wow. I called him during his shift yeah. at Nordstrom's. He uh, he was instantly <laughs> down. We started our friendship before the store, and even though <clears throat> yeah, and uh. Even though one time, uh, he was a big reason why uh, he that that's a big, big reason why I trust him. Uh, we don't agree all the time, <laughs> but <laughs> we never had any crazy problems. Love that dude, Anthony. Throwback style. Love you, bro. Love um, you, bro. And the last one, I need I need you to explain <laughs> what what's happening yo, in, hey, yo. in this picture. Okay, what am I wearing here? I I, I need you to explain. To just show mm. the camera. I need you to explain what's happening in the picture. What's what's happening? Where's that Damn, at? Damn, who took this picture? Who <clears throat> exposed me? Like, okay, this is okay. Nike Town. Obviously, I'm wearing the you know the fuel. Is that the fuel band? The fuel band. <laughs> uh, the fuel this band. Is literally, my uniform. Like, this is this is me. This is probably like 2012. Whoever sent this, I hate you. Uh, I have this a is, rebuttal this is, to this that. Is, this is my look. This is this is me. I have a rebuttal to that, so. sir. Uh, this was the last day of Nike Town SF before oh, they closed yes. for a remodel. Yeah. Basically, like a party. Everyone was just kind of doing whatever, yep. taking pics. 2012. A couple of managers were making malasadas in one of the offices. Oh my god! LOL. Who sent this? I think that <laughs> I think that's where this was. I know someone had a water bottle of not water. LOL. But oh I can't confirm god. who was drinking. <laughs> what a time! <laughs> yes. Damn. How old was I? I don't even think I was. Was I 21? I might have been like literally under 21 because I remember I was going out to uh, 21 and under clubs <laughs> back at Nike. So do you, do you do you know do you have a feeling who sent me this? I don't, but um, whoever it is, I hate you. K. Dap. Oh my God, Christine. Christine. <laughs> 
<laughs> wow. She, she said you were one of her picture. favorites. Yes. She had, she, to, was, she had to dig for me, but one she, of, she one had One of my it. favorite managers for sure. Because I, the craziest sure. thing is that, I don't know why, but I, I did this too, and you and I are on the same wavelength. And all I ask for you is if this kid here... In this picture. Oh my god. In this picture y'all here. Are, y'all are see. airing me. If this kid here has the same dreams that you, you have. This, you see what I'm wearing though? This was a all this was a all over Marvel tee. <laughs> I remember that. Is that a survey? Very, Is that a, was very that iconic. I remember copying this at Hot Topic. Hot Topic oh. had the Marvel tees. And we, we we sold one not too long ago too for like 50, 60 bucks. But yeah. Shout I remember out to the all over Marvel tee. Man, that was maybe <laughs> Fifth, no, sixth, probably sixth or seventh grade. This is a, uh, uh, I think uh, I don't know how yeah, you found that. Uh, damn, really? Yeah. I don't know how you found that. Daniel, do you have any last words? Y'all are y'all are on some Nardwar type <laughs> shit. Um, uh, I already mentioned the address, but you know we're we're open Wednesdays through Saturdays here on Burlingame Math. Uh, follow me on Instagram. Follow the shop on Instagram first and foremost. Archive SF. Uh, follow me, DC's. How many E's in that? Four E's. E's four E's. Four I know. E's. Sorry, it gets confusing, but that's what I've ran with since high day, school. Day so uno. I'm not gonna change it. And I'm sorry, but Jan has that mic. Let's go, Jan. Like, a br- go ahead. What you got, boy? Sorry, I get excited whenever uh, Gus prints stuff out. Yeah. Hell yeah, <laughs> dog. The full, the Yo, did you print that out Bluetooth the, too? The full eight and a half you by dirty 11. Dog, bro. My I boy thought, spent some ink on this. <laughs> yeah. I love it. I thought he, I thought he didn't bring anything today, but um, oh, he did for th- sure. That, that reminds me. He brought uh, the fucking fire, bro. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I heard, fire, bro. I heard you write good essays. Can you help me write my yeah, cover letter? Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. Right, right Damn, out. cover letter. Damn, I haven't done. Yeah, probably. Yeah, you hear that? Can't. Jan is for sale. I will. <laughs> I will proofread it. I will do whatever I can. I got you. This is episode two eleven. Two eleven. Here live. DC's yeah. archive SF. Yeah. Berlin game, California. 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 Free tea. Thank you. Thank, Thank you guys.